Welcome, everybody. So, uh, as, as you noticed, uh, Hyunjimin's not here today. Uh, he asked us to, uh, to share the lecture from Reverend Yu. He, this will be the second lecture from the second day. So, I, I hope the worldwide audience, uh, you, you enjoy this. I, uh, let, let's, let's thank Hyunjinem for this, okay? Let's, thank you. So I'd like to say something about Reverend Yu. As many of you know, Reverend Yu was anointed by Father in 2008 to teach the original substance of divine principle content, uh, which is the completion level of the divine principle all over the world. He, he taught the, this OSDP content 270 times all over the world. That's amazing, amazing, amazing. <laughs> In 2013, after he realized that the Family Fed Federation's Foundation Day had been invaded by Satan, he resigned as head pastor of the Chumbukun Church. Uh, he kept quiet for three years, but then he finally determined to speak out in 2016 and gave the, uh, the first OSDP uh, workshop at the uh, Sanctuary Church in Seoul. Uh, yesterday, Reverend, you mentioned that uh, f Father, Father had a conversation w with a, a world-famous Harvard theologian, and this theologian told Father that he did not believe in God, and that he was just study studying the Bible and religion from an academic point of view. And uh, this... That when, when Reverend Yu mentioned this, it reminded me of the experience that Carrie, Carrie Williams and I had at the Belgium conference. Because at the Belgium conference, uh, Dr. Wilson spoke of the eight great textbooks as a motley collection. Yeah. A as a motley collection. <laughs> and I, I thought... I, I, when, 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 when Andrew said that, I thought, you know, Andrew, w would, you, would, you, would you be willing to say this if Father were here? Would, would, you be, would you say that if Father were here? Of course, the answer is no. But the truth is, Father is here. Yeah. Father is here. Yeah. And he, he will have to repent yeah. for saying the, 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 those things. And he also said that the, the Bible is a, se a sexist document written by men. Oh my God. And, and, you know, I thought about this a lot. And, I, I, you know, Andrew, the Bible is the record of God's sacrifice and the sacrifice of thousands and thousands and thousands of, of men and women to save the world from Satan. Okay, that's what the Bible is. The Bible is. And it's also an introduction and an invitation to meet the Messiah. That's what the Bible is. It's a preparation and the divine principle is preparation to introduce the world to Christ, Amen. to the Messiah. Yeah. So one thing I, I uh, and I'm saying this because I want us to have a context for, for the, this, 
this eight-day uh, OSTP workshop that Revenue has been teaching. And I, I think we need to realize that the FAMI Federation is promoting a non-principled, non-biblical, dualistic theology that is, it, it is, it is a corruption of the divine principle. And, and for that reason, I think we should be really grateful that we have the man the Father anointed to teach the original substance of the divine principle. Okay. I, I don't want the new improved Harvard version of the divine principle. I want the original substance of divine principle that comes from, from Father. Right? So my last question is this. Did the, the, did the Messiah come to be changed by the world or to, or to change the world? Okay. Yeah, that, that, that is really the, the, the thing we have to really think about. So I, uh, anyway, I'm, I'm just, I'm grateful and, and we're, we're truly honored, Reverend Yu, that, and we're, we're thankful to Hyunjinim to allow us to have this experience with you and the whole world, worldwide audience. And I want to thank everyone who is spending this eight-day period here and also around the world, uh, you know, to study with Reverend Yu. So let's welcome Reverend Yu. Thank you. Right, please sit down. So now you're listening through uh, interpreters, and so I think you'll be dif may, may have difficulties because it, the it's uh, difficult to understand this, even if you hear it in your own language. But to hear it uh, through the interpreter says oh, it's very difficult, and I think uh, many uh, uh, much time is necessary. And so now. So the, this, uh, this diagram is very important. And um, uh, if you can understand this uh, diagram, then uh, what comes later will be easier to understand. But if you don't understand this uh, diagram, it will become more and more difficult uh, for you to understand as we go on. As, um, so I said yesterday that uh, at the end, um, uh, I think at the end, uh, you will, all your questions will be answered. But uh, right now, uh, I don't have time to uh, answer questions. I'd like to just so please uh, write your questions down, and uh, uh, maybe those questions will be answered uh, uh, by the, the content uh, that are uh, that is coming. Um, so uh, please, uh, uh, please, uh, uh, um, even though it is difficult to listen through interpreters, I hope that you will do so. And this uh, this uh, explanation of this diagram is extremely important. So at, in the last hour. Uh, we talked, said that the uh, resulting being uh, uh, world has uh, has a common uh, nature. That is, that there's the um, yang nature and yin nature, uh, or positive and negativity, and it's, it's the that it's, that oh, no, so that attribute also exists in the uh, causal uh, world, in the causal being. And so, what uh, what does not exist in the cause cannot exist in the result. And so, then the attributes of the uh, of the uh, causal being then is a original, um, original uh, internal nature, original external nature, original uh, yang, original yin. And so then, and so the, and we, we can understand this, so the, we, God is a unique being. He's one, one God, uh, and he is the Father God. Why is that? Because, because a father has the uh, sperm, uh, the seed. Do you understand that? And so the, that seed that he uh, that is uh, planted uh, vertically, and that is a uh, Eve. So, so that is why Eve is in the object position, uh, and it has the egg, the uh, ova. So then, so then, then look at this uh, uh, diagram. So then here the result has the has the uh, uh, positive, negative, uh, uh, external, internal. One is internal, one is external, and. And then there's a, a, a man and woman who has all these, but the uh, but the, the original substance is one, and it's had all this in, in just him. And But the point is only, but the, but when this comes down vertically, there's only it comes down to a point. There's no area, so it cannot multiply. And so the from this one point, in order to multiply, 
there has to be an area around it. So, so as there has to be creation in the uh, real world. So that is the. So Adam came as the uh, as as the as the extension of the uh, young nature, and then the uh, uh, young nature, and the God uh, Eve as his uh, yin nature. So, so this is the real. So this is in within the young, within the positivity or young nature. Uh, the the yang and yin uh, are within the uh, song sang and hyung sang. Within, uh, so then, so so here in the original being we have uh, the four, but the relationship between this is that the we said the uh, uh, yang and yin have three uh, three relationships. The one is uh, it was the internal and external, and in the fallen world. We said that it's left and right, we say this. But we have up, up and down, um, and front and back, we have that. But is that, but, but if we had, uh, but there's no one who says bottom and up. It says also up and down. It's always, not, not down and up, but always up and down. And, uh, and it's all front and back, not back and front. And so the, so always front is first in our language, and back is the same. Also, uh, because there's up, there's also bottom. So we can say, we, can, we don't we don't say bottom and up. We say oh, we say bo up and bottom, up and lower. So, and so there is this order there in the also in the created world, and so here, so this uh, these attributes exist here and within God, and they're here. See that uh, um, that uh, so here. Young, young. If that uh, uh, is uh, young, is represents represents a man. So a man goes out and uh, does external activities. So the man is external, and the uh, the woman is in the home and is a uh, is an internal. This is how we explain it. So in the appear in the appeared world, that's how it uh, wor appears. But the but when you look at the relationship between yang and yin. When we say what which is the what is the uh, uh, subject partner, uh, and so the internal is the subject partner. In the east, in the Orient, um, there was a there was a ch book called the Myongshim Pogam, and it, this was a prophecy text, and it said that the that uh, the father gave birth to me, and my mother nurtured me, and I studied this when I was sixteen. In this book. And and when I heard this, I thought, wait a second, I was born from my mother, not my father. So my mother gave birth to me, and she she nurtured me. This is what I thought. But here in this uh, text, it says that the uh, father gave birth to me, and mother uh, nurtured me. So why is that? Why does it say this? Um, so it could not be explained. I asked people, and they couldn't explain it to me. But now I understand it because I've heard the principle. Through the principle, I can understand it. Why? What does it say in the principle? That the it says that the uh, uh, man is internal, and the woman, woman is external, because the man has the seed. He is the sperm, the seed, and so and he plants the seed in the in the field. And the, the the field is external, uh, but the seed is internal. And so the so when when you say that the uh, when we say that the father gave birth to me, it means that the sperm of the father uh, created me. So woman does not have the seed. So the seed, she receives the seed, and then uh, and then, and then she has the life elements that is able to uh, nurture that seed so that it can grow. And that is the uh, that is the egg, uh, as the ova. It only co appears once a month, but the, the uh, seed can can come uh, at, at any time. So the so who has that so who has that uh, seed of life? Is the father. And so so the where does it where is it planted? It's a uh, uh, planted uh, in the uh, ova of the woman. And so the so the so the father is the center, and then the father then. So that's why yang is internal and uh, yin uh, is uh, uh, internal. And so that is why uh, ancient texts in Korea also say that the, the father uh, gave birth to me and my mother nurtured me. 
So the, 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 the mother uh, receives a seed and then uh, in her womb, within her womb, she nurtures and, and grows that seed. And so here, and so the uh, uh, yang is uh, um, internal and yang, yin and external. Do you understand that? And uh, here, so here we have a The uh, yang is we, we have the yang on the left and the yin on the right. But here, the top and but uh, here, but here we have the right and left reversed. So not left and right, but right and left. Why does it uh, change? Uh, because the uh, because Eve fell in the uh, Garden of Eden, uh, she changed the order of things. And so, so uh, God is the uh, object partner, and the, the uh, and he would uh, have uh, uh, he would, uh, and he was uh, to, through uh, Adam and Eve uh, he would to uh, uh, have dominion over the uh, have a dominion over the archangel, but but uh, he left that position and became Satan he, because he left his position he became Satan. So who so he uh, had dominion over Eve, and Eve uh, fell. And then the Eve then, uh, who did she cause to fall? Uh, she caused Adam, Adam to uh, fall and to uh, have dominion over him. And so then the, the whole order, uh, the order uh, changed, uh, and the, and this is what we learned in the in the fall. And so the, uh, if we can explain it a little bit better, why do we call it left and right? Because, because Eve uh, created a wrong. Uh, order so it's when we so we when we need to change that we cannot just uh, go along with the, the wrong thing so so in the, uh, in the OSTP we've changed we've changed everything so it's not left and right it's right and left so the, so are men and weak men and uh, men and equal then because they are not the same they are they are not equal in the sense that they are same so what mother says the he says, we are equal. How can he teach me? We are equal. How, there's no way for a husband to teach the wife, he says. But you look at father's words. He, uh, he met mother and he, uh, he uh, sacrificed himself and invested himself fully in order to nurture mother and to teach her. As he said that he taught her, but then any 36 couples all know this. They saw this. And yet, mother says that uh, she was never, uh, never learned anything from father. And that he, he, I'm equal to him, so how can he teach me? Now, how, how does that make sense? So, one of the reasons I speak this way, like this today, is not to criticize anyone, but to say that, but uh, we must not uh, uh, teach a wrong principle. And you are asking uh, uh, these kinds of questions, and so that's why I'm speaking this way. But, but once we hear the principle, uh, then everything else makes sense. So. We don't need to criticize anything, and because we don't know the principle. That's why, is it this or this is that? Uh, so the, but uh, the the principle uh, comes from God, and so we didn't know the uh, the uh, the original substance of that principle. And that is why we get confused. So here, we uh, talk about we talked about the subject partner object partner relationship, and so then. So the so with the we, why we call this the first first cause. Some well, one young person asked me this. There is the resulting world, and then there is a cause for that uh, a result. Well, let's call that the God. Let's call that God. So then God uh, God is the cause, and where did He come from? One person asked me. So there must be a cause to that cause, and so then he, God must then is a resultant being. God so. It, the, in the end, we keep going back and back and back, and eventually there's a, a nothing. So it's easy for materialist to to, uh, to ask that kind of question. There must be a cause, and then a cause of that cause, and a cause of that cause, and so forth, and go back. And so the uh, what we call God the first cause. So Arist uh, Aristotle also Aristotle also uh, uh, talked about this, and uh, he said that ultimately there has to be a. Uh, the, the first uh, uh, first material and that the external form uh, that is the the first the first uh, form and that the pure pure form and and a pure energy 
that is a matter. If it's the, uh, that the pure matter is a first matter, and uh, the, the pure uh, form uh, is the, as they said, is God. Uh, uh, so Aristotle, so Aristotle became a dualist in this way, and uh, well, uh, I think uh, there will be time to talk about that later. So then, so within the, uh, the original substance, there is the cause, and there is not the fr cause of that cause, but but we call uh, that God is the first cause. There is no cause of Him. So then. When we start counting, we start with one. We don't start with two. And but uh, we start with zero. But uh, zero does not have value. So we start with counting with one. And so when we say, say the first, say so it is the we said it is the first. There's nothing else. So that is that is God. And then He is one. He is unique. And so then, how is He one? So God then here we should look at the result then. With the original uh, Song Sang, original Hyung Sang, and he is the uh, harmonized union of those, and he's also the harmonized union of uh, um, of uh, original uh, uh, Yang uh, of uh, Yang and original Yin, and, so, and we uh, we say that he is a father because he is in a subject partner position. So then, the, so the father is not two, but he is one, and he is the first cause, and in the uh, religion religion uh, he is called the. Um, he is called God, and so then here there there's a they call him by different names, uh, but uh, uh, they, they see. But in any case, uh, he is the first cause. So in Christianity, he, and we say that he is not just a conceptual God, but he is my my father. So why is he my father? Because we because human beings were born from his seed from his. Uh, so, and that's what makes us different from the rest of creation. So that all, uh, that, uh, all things are the symbolic representation of God, but uh, human beings were uh, created in the image of God. And then the, who we, the, uh, he created two, Adam and Eve. So who is the one who, uh, who is the, the one uh, among them who uh, attends to God in, in reality, in, in, in substance, in substance? To, so they were both born, and they go up to per, reach perfection, and they, they they must become one, centering on a God. That would be marriage. It's only do they get do they marry just on on their own, or they get married uh, centering uh, on God? They uh, centered on God, and so when they become then, so who is the house of God then? He is the he is the uh, male subject partner, and so the so Adam's uh, body becomes uh, the temple of God, and then it, uh, and so he is the son of God, and he is God's body. And Eve, he's the, she is the daughter and the wife uh, of and the bride of Adam. And so vertically speaking, uh, um, uh, God is the subject and, and uh, Adam is the object, but, in, in the, but as the subject partner, and, uh, and Adam is the object partner, but uh, Adam is the bo uh, body, and uh, uh, God is the uh, mind, and then uh, Adam becomes the substantial God. So he becomes the visible God. And then vertically, or horizontally speaking, who is the subject? Adam is the subject partner, and Eve is the object partner. Why is Adam the subject partner? Because, because uh, he is the temple to, into which a God dwells. So then well, that is what makes order very clear. So that's why it has to, we have to think of it in terms of relations. So here in the first cause, we have the a harmonious union of original original nature and a original uh, external form, and is the position he's the masculine subject party. He's not two. There's not there are not two fathers. There cannot be two fathers. No matter how, no matter uh, even if uh, uh, even if a woman has a relations with many men, still there's just one seed. And so there cannot be uh, two fathers. But uh, but how about mother? Also, there cannot be two mothers. So, if we would come in with another woman, uh, then that would be that was not that would not be the mother that gave birth to you. Is that would be stepmother? But uh, but uh, the um, father and mother are just one. And so then, <coughs> so then we've uh, we've talked about the relationship between uh, yang nature and yin nature, and in the so here. 
So here, as we uh, we talked about the dot, God's two dual characteristics, but how many characteristics do you see? Listen to this carefully. How many character? He is the dual characteristic according to a different principle. But you look at this, but you look at this uh, 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 this diagram. How many are there? There are four characteristics. So, so this is a quadra characteristics, you could say. Uh, but someone might say, so this uh, already in, a, in the 1960s, uh, this question was already asked to. Uh, to Father, when the Father met the famous uh, theologians in uh, Korea at a, uh, how, a building called the uh, uh, Ac Academy House, and he uh, presented the principle to them, this is the question that they had. I thought you said dual characteristics. Well, we see four. It's quadra characteristics. Uh, this, uh, this is what the theologians uh, uh, pointed out and asked the question. And this, and uh, Father answered their question. He said, "It's not quadra; it's dual." And why is that? Because the uh, yang and yin uh, are the attributes of the uh, original uh, internal nature and external form. So they are attributes. And see, they are in the uh, they are in the first cause, but they but they are attributes attributes of original internal nature and original external form. So they are attributes, and so uh, so the the original substance. Uh, the original uh, substance, uh, original substance uh, is a uh, 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 essentially internal nature and external forms like mind and body. And then the, so then the, if the he is one, and then is he going to be a woman or is he going to be a man? So the, if he has two substances, there's there can be no peace. So there, there will always be fighting. Isn't that right? So, if a man and wife uh, have a, a different uh, desires, they uh, fight or they separate. So, eternally, eternally, uh, if uh, that eternal existence can only be uh, possible if God has just one uh, substance. So that one unique God uh, is the is the uh, divine nature of God. But then uh, the Christianity said, "Well, it's a." Oh, he is the uh, God of love. Uh, he is the omnipresent, omnipresent but, he's, uh, but we are talking about it in more essential terms. And there's the, there's the uh, original uh, internal nature, and original external form. And then, then that has, has the uh, attributes of original yang and original yin. So why is it attributes? Is that we'll talk about that more uh, in the next hour. So that's why I say, so don't... Uh, uh, I know that you have many questions, uh, but I think that the questions that you have now will be answered in the next hour or maybe in some time after that. And so if you have doubts, uh, so if you start doubting, then uh, nothing will remain uh, in your mind. And so just uh, open your hearts uh, and empty your hearts and uh, receive these words, um, and uh, that is how you can uh, uh, listen to them. So you have to uh, open uh, your hearts in order to receive these words. So please, uh, I, I, I've been asking you to do that. So here, in the original uh, first cause, uh, it, it, uh, it looks like a four characteristics, but actually, uh, fundamentally, it is two uh, dual, dual characteristics. And, it is, and so the, it's the so yang and yin are attributes of the uh, two uh, more essential uh, internal uh, nature and external form. Do you understand this? So then now, uh, look at this diagram. So the, uh, this, this is, well, so you talk about to the, you know, the, the people might say, well, look, fam family federation, talking about mother God and father God. Well, uh, that might, might be right, but I'm explaining how that is wrong. Uh, so, they, their uh, their uh, principle is wrong. That's not Father's words. That's not Father God's words. And so that is why the issue. That is why it's a problem. And so then, now here, uh, let's continue and talk about the. So here in the, so the Songsang and Hyongsang is the center, and the Yang and Yin are attributes, and are they the, and are the. Uh, the attributes the center or the uh, more essential uh, uh, song sang hyung sang the, the more the center so it's the it's the young it's the song sang hyung sang that are the center so here uh, when the, the god's uh, song sang hyung sang appear in 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 reality uh, they, uh, as a mind and body so the 
So you, you've heard that uh, God is a mind and body, so you have not heard that. So in divine principle also does not give, uh, uh, does not uh, express a uh, mind and body of God. Why is that? Because uh, the time was not right. Why? Because the because uh, only when we we can uh, use the expression mind and body of God only when we uh, express it in terms of, uh, of of God being the original substance of of the principle. And so in the divine principle, it, uh, it does not uh, uh, talk about uh, sperm, does not use that word. Uh, not that it couldn't, but because the time wasn't right. So there's a father, though, in Korea, uh, educated many leaders uh, in this way. And uh, the highest leaders uh, were professors, and uh, uh, he uh, established the Professor's World a Peace Academy, PWPA. And then from that time, uh, centering on the professors, uh, he had many uh, assemblies, and he spoke to, at those assemblies. But then uh, at, after a certain time, the uh, leaders uh, came together from around the country, and the professors, they, uh, they came to uh, hear Father's words, and he started talking about concave and convex. He talked, he, 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 they, instead of, Instead of uh, talking about to them as a, uh, another way, he expressed it as concave and co convex. Concave and convex is how he started talking about it. So the professors were very surprised. They were shocked. Why? Because uh, this, is, uh, uh, this is not allowed uh, in society. Uh, the people don't talk this way. But, these, but, these, the, but the, the uh, man who had been teaching them the truth uh, gets up and starts talking about uh, uh, concave and convex. And so these people, well, they uh, turned red in their face, and they actually were so embarrassed that they, some people just uh, kept looking down because they were so embarrassed. Uh, and then the, the father then pointed uh, for the person and said, you, uh, you, you also were embarrassed, weren't you? So, because uh, he could not uh, announce this. Now, these days, you talk about concave, convex, there's nothing, isn't it? You don't, you don't react, you don't even react. Uh, so, uh, and... But uh, that's true in the West. But even in the in the East, is more so. You cannot talk about that in public at that time. Is that, wow, this is well, now something terrible. Now something terrible is happening. Something bad has happened to our leaders. He said, and then they went back to their homes, and uh, the people who couldn't at, at, attend, they said, well, uh, well, you went to Reverend Moon and you met him. What did he talk about? And they're always curious, right? And then the professor said, well, today. Uh, uh, I, I heard about uh, concave and convex. That was the answer. There was w w nothing else, just a concave and convex. So the, w really? W oh, that's strange. Uh, that uh, uh, old man, that old man, he's become strange. Uh, and then they, and they called him together again. And then he started to talk about it even more, um, even even more clearly. So then, and then he called them again, and he talked about more fundamental things. And then the, uh, that that old man. Uh, why? Why is he? Why does he keep talking about this? Uh, he's, he's talking like, uh, but he was not talking in a in a uh, 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 in a way that uh, a fallen world talked about. So he was talking about how he was talking about how this is the most holy part of the body. Uh, he and then they finally understood that the, the sexual organs are the most holy part of the uh, body. And they said, Ah, this is the truth. The most the most fundamental uh, truth uh, about the human body is the uh, sexual organs. But uh, Satan has made this a very bad thing, uh, as if uh, we, we commit sin just by talking about them. And so if we start talking about uh, uh, sexual organs, it's, oh, no, 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 it's, uh, oh, we can't go there anymore. Uh, look, the unification church is talking about uh, sexual organs. It's a sexual uh, 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 group. It's, uh, but, so the, but Father talked about the preciousness. Uh, 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 that's why, and so that's why Father spoke about it. So I said yesterday that the true uh, sons and daughters of God, if we are to be registered uh, in the kingdom of heaven, then the final test is the test of sex. Um, and if, when we are past that, then we become the some, true sons and daughters of God. And that is when we can uh, multiply sons and daughters of God. But uh, but we, we, we fell because of, we, of, of Satan. And that uh, the test of sex is the final test. And so 
uh, when when a man, in order for a man to go into the kingdom of heaven, have to be a hundred of the most beautiful women in the world and line them up uh, in two rows, uh, completely naked, and the man has to pass through that, uh, pass between the, those two lines, uh, and then without his uh, sexual organ becoming excited, uh, being stimulated. So uh, if uh, if, he's, if it's that sexual organ is excited even a little bit, oh, you don't qualify yet. You have to go back. And for a woman to get into the kingdom of heaven, have to line up the uh, uh, 100 most handsome men in the world uh, in naked, and then she has to walk through uh, those uh, two lines. And then her mind has to be completely centered without influence, uh, without being influenced at all. She'll, oh, I'd like to have make love with that man. If she has even a small bit of a desire like that, then she does not pass. The father has passed that test. And to see, um, Father, not that he actually stood a hundred women, uh, but uh, uh, but he many w beautiful women uh, tried to uh, tempt him, but uh, they failed. And, and so, uh, if Satan was able to uh, make Father fall, that would be the end. Uh, but uh, um, but uh, they were for heavenly lineage would be would, would not uh, would would be the end. Uh, but uh, but Father. But the Father has to uh, maintain that uh, and protect that uh, uh, lineage, uh, no matter what. I think you've heard this story uh, that uh, a father during the uh, colonial period went to Japan, and, and uh, Korea um, uh, was uh, a colony, and uh, uh, the police, Japanese police uh, were always uh, following around a father and trying to compromise him. And, uh, and if anyone were to uh, report him to the police as, as having done something bad, then the father would go immediately to the jail. And so then a, a and, um, and there was a, a police station right next to uh, his uh, boarding house in, in Japan, in, in Tokyo. And uh, uh, right now you can go there, you can see the sign that a certain police station used to be there. But, uh, but if, and if someone were to uh, report him to the police, then they would immediately take him away and start torturing him. So the most difficult thing for him was that was that the temptation by Japanese women. Uh, the Japanese uh, beautiful women would uh, uh, would uh, appear uh, because there were a lot of uh, 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 Japanese women and uh, Korean women uh, uh, who were studying at the university, and the, many of them tried to tempt him uh, because because uh, he is the original substance of love, and so they were attracted to him. They didn't know what, they didn't didn't even know why, and so they and so. And sometimes uh, he would be sitting down, and a beautiful woman would would uh, try to, uh, to grab his hand. So, so what, what was more fearful for for, for, for father was that uh, some beautiful woman would come and try to uh, tempt him and, and uh, to approach him. So then he, so he, and so then uh, um, he would uh, wear old clothes and uh, unwashed clothes so that uh, he would smell strange to keep the women away. And so then, what but what happened then? So the the a woman a woman would come would try to come with money and to give him money. Uh, to, he absolutely refused that kind of temptation. So the, he he uh, uh, collected uh, um, uh, old iron, uh, scrap iron, for example, in order to support himself. Uh, to, he never accepted uh, money uh, from uh, those kinds of women. Uh, to, he uh, had to, did difficult jobs in order to. Do that. So then, uh, fi finally, he uh, locked he uh, locked the door. Uh, he put uh, three locks on his door to keep uh, the, them from coming in, so they couldn't have them. But then one day, he came in uh, after work, and all those locks were open, had been unlocked by someone. And he went into his room, and and uh, the that the beautiful woman was trying to tempt him. Uh, she was a virgin, and uh, she uh, she had uh, put out the bedding uh, on the floor, and uh, she was lying there naked. And uh, her father went in there, and uh, she grabbed hold of him, and please, let's make love. That's what, what would you do in that kind of situation? And then that time, Father said this, I cannot do that. I cannot do that. And I, I cannot explain it. So then, but she's grabbing hold of him. Just five minutes, just five minutes, please. So why do you, why do you resist, she says. And it's, I'm, just, uh, I'm just telling you what, exactly what Father told me. So, see, so why it just takes five minutes? Why do you, why do you say no? So I said, no, it can't, not even five minutes. Why, why not, she says. How, how can he explain this? Uh, he cannot uh, beat her either. Uh, she might go right to the police. Uh, look, that, that, uh, that uh, moon, he, uh, did this, he did this to me, this did this to me. And then uh, they would take, her, take him away. And then he would be taken away to the police station. And, and uh, uh, so, so he had to uh, subjugate her naturally, not forcefully. Is how, that's, that's difficult. That was the most difficult thing he said. 
And so then he said, uh, I am not able, to, I'm a man, but I'm not, able, I'm not able to function as a man, he said to her. And so then the woman said, well, let's, let's, uh, let's, let's see. Let's see. So what is he going to do? So all right, do what you want, he said. And then, and then the uh, woman uh, uh, took off his uh, clothes and he well, took off his clothing, and he said he, he said that the, he was half in the spirit world and half in the physical world at that moment. He said, and so the she tried her best to uh, excite his uh, sexual organ, but uh, it did not move. It did not excite at all. Uh, it would not function. It did not function. So this woman finally said, Ah, he's a man, but uh, he's not able to function as a man. And so then, and so she put on her clothes and actually she bowed and said, I'm sorry, I apologize, and left the room. And that is the, that is, that, that was when Father was 23 years old, when after he met to Jesus at 16 years old, and he, uh, he established the standard of uh, absolute sex. He established that as his standard. So no matter what kind of temptation may come, no, he, uh, he would absolutely maintain uh, the, his uh, sexual organ, because that is the heavens uh, lineage. Even at the cost of his life, he would uh, maintain that, uh, and then, uh, and that he was doing that. So for seven years, uh, he had to uh, have that victory in seven years. So even after he went to Japan to study them, uh, he was at uh, 23 years old, and this was the final test that he had then with that woman. And after after uh, passing that test, God said to him, "From now on." I will uh, allow you to, I will, I will uh, uh, give you all the women in this world. Um, <clears throat> the, the, so treat them as your, as your uh, daughter, as your uh, younger sister, and r uh, raise them up so that they can receive the blessing. And he gave them, that's when God gave him the authority of the blessing. And in the, but uh, uh, Satan was in charge of all those women in the world. So then, so then uh, now, but now uh, God gave him the authority to take, to bring all those women back to God. And then at that point, that was when mother was born. So the, uh, they are 23 years. There's 23 years difference between father and mother. And from, so at the moment, at the time that uh, father received the authority from God uh, to uh, bring all women back to God, um, uh, that is when, uh, that is when uh, mother was born. And these, no one, no one understands this. No one knows this. So then, from that point, that absolute uh, sex uh, uh, can be established because he, uh, we know God, and because He knew also the uh, human portion of responsibility. That's why how He could establish that standard of absolute sex. So then. Within our uh, mind, there is, we say we resemble God's uh, God's mind, and that is the song song, and that is the essential uh, essential attribute, and, and and it is the essential attribute. The, the mind is the uh, mind is the, uh, the, the it is the shimjong. There are many attributes, a uh, countless number of attributes to God, but the most uh, most uh, essential attribute uh, is uh, shimjong. But then they. The God's Shimjong, we say uh, Shimjong in a word, but uh, there are the four, uh, the four realms of Shimjong, four realms of heart, of, of parents, of husband, wife, of uh, children, and of siblings. Those are the four uh, great realms of the Shimjong or of heart. <coughs> and then the, then the, that Shimjong, if we express that in a word, it's the, uh, God is the uh, original substance of, uh, of Shimjong or that, that, then what, then what is true love? The true love is the is what comes from God's shimjong, and so God's essential attribute is shimjong, and that is the root of His true love, and is the and is the core of His uh, character. That is shimjong. Without shimjong, there can be no true love. Without true without a true a shimjong, there can be no life. Not not true life. Why? Because uh, true life comes from uh, love. Without the Shimjong, there can be there will be no lineage. So, so lineage uh, and Shimjong are in a very close relationship. So, so God said, if you eat of the fruit, you will die. Uh, 
because of, of that is the that is the path that Adam and Eve had to go. And if they had maintained that a word, then they would have become the the substance or the substantial beings of Shim Jong. Then they would have been able to be blessed by God in marriage. And so now God, uh, here we have the mind, and his essential characteristic is uh, attribute is of Shim Jong. And, and we say that that's easy. He is the uh, he is a, a infinite uh, spirit. We say that, uh, and we call it, and then and it is described as a divine nature. And then the then the, also his form is the same. So we we talk about the uh, the uh, this is comes from a universal prime force. There's the there's the force that uh, there's the causal force that allows everything to exist, and that is the uh, allows the created world to exist. And, it's the, and so, the root of re, root of all the creation is energy. We said, and in the the energy before there was that energy, uh, there was the energy in the original substance, uh, and that was the universal prime force. And in the not just energy, but as the but it has a, a principle uh, and a, a law and order. So. When God, God doesn't uh, just uh, do anything that He just doesn't uh, uh, do anything uh, just uh, without order. It always there's principle. He always moves according to principle and always according to law and always according to order. And so the this, uh, the order is law and the law is principle. With the uh, these the three are not separate. That the principle itself is the law. War, the principle itself is the order. And so then that is all within God. And so this content. That he, he is one, and so, but he can only uh, has one one point. But a point has no area, and so in order to have area, uh, there has to be uh, exist in a substantial form, and that is two, and that is the, the these come from, uh, they are they are the substantial beings of God's attributes, as the, as the uh, God is the, the harmonization of dual characteristics within these, then. They come as a dual dual beings of, uh, that repret, that uh, uh, come from God's dual characteristics. If if uh, if there were a Father God and a Mother God, then uh, uh, then then do, does God have do Mother God and Father God have to make make love? How can that be possible? Uh, the with the uh, uh, incorporeal beings cannot do that. You understand? And so then the the. The, uh, they could just uh, keep making love and keep uh, creating human beings. Why did uh, why would God create only uh, Adam and Eve uh, if there were Mother God and Father God? And so, uh, right now, what we are saying is the song sung, the song sung. The this is infinite energy, and as the and then we. And uh, the, the uh, uh, Bible expresses this in the term power. So God's power, uh, the, the power of God is, is a, a pure, apparent uh, in the creation, it says. And so, then the, and so the power of God is, is, uh, corresponds to God's form. And so the, so, so the human uh, mind uh, resembles uh, God's mind. What do we need to do then? We. We are the like the receptacle uh, of a God's mind. What do we need to put in that? Uh, we we have to that receptacle needs to receive God's mind. God's that's a song song, His internal nature, His uh, shimjong, His uh, uh, heart and His character. These uh, attributes uh, need to be uh, put in the receptacle that is our mind. But it right now is empty. Do I? Uh, but but God has given us the elements that we that uh, give us the ability to do that. Do that. Those are elements, and in that. Uh, that that those elements though they need to create some substantial being. Well, let me give an example. So if you go to the countryside in Korea, uh, raising raising rice, they're growing rice, and um, uh, as a, the, the rice uh, stalks, uh, the fruit is the rice and, and the rice stalks, and then the and, the, and it's like a, a grass in the beginning. It like it looks like weeds in the beginning. But then, it, uh, then it, uh, uh, but it uh, multiplies. And after two months, uh, you have to. Then uh, the uh, seeds come, and then the, and there are a lot of uh, uh, fruit or that or that, and then the, that that is the 
the uh, brown skin around the uh, the rice the seed, and then there's a flower that comes up, and as the the the, uh, the flower comes out, and then and the flower blooms, and it, the the um, it, um, it, um, separates like that. And then the, do you know what the rice flower looks like? It's white, and it falls on the ground. And then, then what was opened there to allow the flower to bloom closes again. And then and there's a, a very sweet a water, a, a liquid that is in there. The, there's a very sweet liquid in there, and that, becomes, that, become, that can become rice, and it becomes a seed. And so then, we, well, we don't call that rice, though. It, it be, it's an element that becomes rice in the future. And so the, that has not yet become the seed. It is the element that be, can become the seed. And so then that has to mature for it to be the actual rice or the seed. And so then when that becomes a hardened, uh, it becomes rice, and then you plant that, uh, then it grows as rice. So in our hearts as well, we have the, our mind is created to resemble his uh, song sang, his internal nature. Then, then uh, we uh, we need to resemble uh, his uh, uh, love and shim jong and uh, and uh, character, but we have the elements that allow us to do that. So, but we but we need to grow in order for that to happen, uh, so that that those elements uh, that God has given us uh, mature into that. So these, but it has to be an object partner, and so then that's why we have the four great realms of shim jong or heart, and so the parents' heart, the. Shim Jong of parents, the of uh, of uh, uh, husband and wife Shim Jong, uh, the uh, parent, uh, the uh, ch children's Shim Jong, and the sibling Shim Jong, and so the but uh, he is the uh, original substance, so he has no form, he has no uh, sub, he, 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 and so that is why. But he, we are the his uh, substantial beings, and so that is why we must uh, get married, and so then, uh, so we 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 can feel feel the uh, Shim Jong of the parents. To do that, we need children, and then the uh, we raise. Uh, uh, we raise uh, those children, they become husband and wife, and then they will uh, have children, and uh, they, they all resemble their parents, uh, each generation will. And so then, so the, we uh, resemble the one God, and He is the, uh, that he is the, uh, uh, the original substance, and He gives a seed that can become either a man or a woman. And we'll talk about this later in the workshop. So, so the, in God there is the uh, seed, and it's not, not, but not one, but two. There is the seed for the uh, ma a woman, and also a seed that become, can become a daughter. So the, so the, if we only had, a, do we have a only a sons or only daughters? No. So, when uh, once uh, well, a man ejaculates, there are three uh, hundred thousand to five hundred thousand uh, uh, sperm, and then. Then the, uh, they can go. So the, if, and then, but then each. Uh, and then, but if that's a seed, if, if the, if the uh, male seed, if the, if the male seed is stronger and uh, goes to the ova, uh, then uh, then uh, uh, fertilizes the uh, ova, then that becomes the the, uh, uh, the fetus. And that becomes a son. If the uh, female uh, seed uh, goes first to the ova, then it become, that uh, child will become a female. So uh, we will talk about this biologically uh, later on. Uh, the, the, and that is why God, uh, it's a, not, 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 he's not parent, he's a father. So the, so the but, uh, but uh, when Adam and Eve become parents, then God takes on uh, takes on their uh, body, and that is when He becomes true parents. You understand? So then, so in the process, we say that we say that uh, some people say that He's a Father God and Father uh, Father Mother Mother God and Father Mother. So also Messiah. There's a uh, Father Messiah and Mother Messiah. So also there's a only begotten daughter as well as only begotten son. So what happens then? Do you mean that there are two original substances? There are attributes, yes, but the, but uh, but uh, he's just one, and he, uh, he he is the father. There's only one, and he is the father. Do you understand this? There's not father and mother God, but just one. And the, 
a male is the heaven and a female represents the earth. And Jesus uh, was born uh, on the earth, but he said he came from heaven. Isn't that right? He said, he, didn't he say in the Bible, he says he say, came from heaven. So uh, he said only people who come from heaven can go back to heaven. He came, in other words, he came from, from, from the Father. And Father is the same. He was born on the earth, but he came from heaven. Uh, he came as the Son of God. And this is the beginning. This was where he started from. But that son, did he have an original son, original sin at the beginning? Then he's not the Son of God if he had original sin at the beginning. Because original sin comes from Satan. So these kind of fundamental issues uh, are, uh, are, are now being discussed and, and we are being argued about uh, in our faith. It's, these are very fundamental things. So then, because of that then, so today, we, well, the person who's standing at the center uh, says that and says, oh, well, it must be right. No, right is right and wrong is wrong. No matter what kind of leader says it, uh, if Father says it's wrong, it's wrong. But because Father's not here, and then uh, we have the Father's words and uh, His principle. We have that. And this is eternal. It cannot be changed. And so the what if is, so it has to be according to principle and it has to be according to Father's words. If it is not according to the principle or if it's not according to Father's words, then it is wrong. And we have this, we have to be very certain about this. And so this is why, that's why we need to do the OSTP education. If we don't do this education, these very fundamental issues will not be resolved. There will be confusion. This is very, this is very serious and very fundamental. And so, so that's why Hyung Jinim today uh, has been attacking mother and um, uh, uh, people in the secular world say that he is a uh, unfilial child. How can a how can a son attack his mother that way? He uses a, 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 a phrases that are never used in uh, even in secular society. Why is that? Because he hates her. He loves her more than anyone. That's how I uh, that's how I see it. But but because he loves her, he does this. Because the one he loves is is a, a understands wrongly, and so he wants to teach her. So then he attacks her so that uh, she can come to these realizations. But the more he does, they, she says no, 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 and the people around her say no, no, no. Then, then, uh, then, uh, the, then the, uh, there's a human proportion of responsibility, though. The right now we are living in this kind of very serious uh, uh, situation. They see. We are supposed to be the salt of the earth and the light, of, but light according to this word. But now, within, but now we we have this problem within ourselves. So, how would the people outside think? How would they sit? Oh, look! Well, why don't you uh, fix yourselves first? Don't don't teach us. We cannot do witnessing right now. They say just oh, heal yourself. They say. So the oh Unification Church. Well, you, let's see you guys uh, uh, unite. Uh, you, uh, you call yourself Unification Church. Uh, you're all divided. How can you call yourself Unification Church? And we have no answer. So that's the reality. So then, he, uh, if and, and if this were just some people at the uh, bottom of our of our organization doing this, but that's not the case. So then, he, oh, why well, we just going to say, okay, well, we must uh, decide this, right? We just uh, follow? No, I cannot do that. Uh, Father will not do that, and God will not do that because it's not principle, and it's not the words that Father taught. So then we start talking like this. Um, people in the Family Federation will say, oh, well, there's a, a Reverend Yu went to the sanctuary uh, uh, headquarters, and, and uh, this is what he said. Pro they'll probably talk this way. But uh, how about you? Um, you? You put this on the Internet and YouTube, right? And so then, then okay. so uh, what, they'll say, well, what is, what is he trying to do? And in regular people, they won't even um, uh, uh, relate to it. They'll just ignore it. But they cannot ignore Reverend Yu. I'm, I'm sorry to say, they cannot ignore when I say it, because what I, uh, because uh, I think uh, they see that the, the words that I speak will have a lot of influence. Because when Father was here, uh, he sent me around the uh, six continents, and it was, I could give the. Uh, uh, I don't know much about computers, uh, but uh, they, uh, but they, uh, I don't know them, but they know me. Yeah, so. So, uh, 
I saw until now, for three years, I was quiet. But as I watch, things are not going the way that Father uh, taught. And the things that Father taught are were many, and many people heard them. Um, and, and, um, but the, these fundamental issues are being, how, how they're being going. Uh, but uh, Father taught me things that uh, he taught me, and uh, that he uh, very fundamental things. And I didn't know why he was teaching me these things uh, uh, at that time, but now I see. That's why he taught me. Uh, now I see why he taught me. Uh, this it has to be, uh, he, uh, he emphasized certain things. This is how you have to teach this thing. And some things he told me to keep secret. And and uh, uh, before he uh, went, uh, uh, he said to he said, I I. I raised a, you, a Reverend Yu. Uh, he didn't know anything, but he was pure, and that's why I raised him, he said. So then that he knew that I would understand exactly as he taught, not mix my own thinking uh, into him. If he had uh, taught some scholar, that would not have happened, because he has his own knowledge and his own uh, viewpoint. And so that would, and, uh, he would uh, insert that into Father's teaching. But I didn't have that. Uh, so. Uh, this is white. If he says this is white, I would say, okay, that's white. And if he says black, I would say, okay, it's black. Exactly as he taught. And, and, the, and that is what Father sees as precious. Not uh, not uh, uh, PhDs or, or doctorates. Uh, that is not what he sees as precious. So that is why. That, so the important things uh, he taught me very quietly. And at the end, you see, uh, I, th I told you not to say this, didn't I? But from now on, you can. He said, he said even the things I didn't teach you, you can just uh, say them all. He said, he said I, that doesn't mean that I'll just uh, speak anything I want to. What he means is that uh, uh, what the words that I speak uh, will, 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 because he knows that I just don't just speak on my own position. So he said to teach everything that I taught you, and if anything else you want to say, go ahead and say that too, he told me. So then, but I cannot just uh, speak uh, randomly, though. Isn't that right? So then today, uh, our conclusion uh, for this hour right now is that uh, there are 7.3 billion people in the world today. And, uh, and, um, but uh, but uh, God's ideal uh, comes about uh, when we have the ideal uh, man and woman. They are ideal human beings. If that's it. So the uh, we have the God created us in a, a, a visible form and also invisible form for the nervous system, for example, has the visible aspect and invisible aspect, uh, and the uh, and the and if even one uh, if even one thing that God created is not there, then we, we will die. For example, if we if one uh, artery is not there, then we will die. If it's cut, we will die. So everything that it has to be exactly as God created, and the and the scientists uh, come together uh, and. And in, in our brain, everything is there. It's more than all the scientists, all their information is put together on a chip. It is um, uh, even more information of that is, uh, is, the, is the, our brain. So God is the original uh, scientist. He's the greatest scientist, and he's the eternal scientist. And then uh, this is a uh, uh, human beings are, are able to are able to develop uh, uh, develop infinitely. So the brain uh, scientists who say the brain say that. Uh, that uh, the computers that we have today, will we have a robot? Uh, maybe uh, after after ten years, we'll have robots. will be doing the uh, things that uh, that that, uh, that we are doing. So then, and um, the in our house, the robots will clean our house uh, and they'll make up our meals. And uh, the and the and um, I will. And you can tell the robot, uh, I'm going to get home at a certain time, so you need to have the dinner ready for me. Then what are human beings going to do then? And then the, what is going to do then? Then the, and then, in the, in the, in the, in the, 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 uh, going to 40 countries, you can basically see uh, what the world is like. And that will be, uh, then we can see that uh, in the world. But uh, but a person who doesn't uh, hasn't done that, even goes to the spirit world, will not uh, understand what is going on there. 
And uh, one leader came to Father and he said, uh, uh, I, like, I, I like all animals, but I hate cats, one leader said to Father. But uh, what, I, what will happen if I go to the spirit world and, and I, I come across a cat? What am I going to do there? How do you think Father answered that? Any animal that you don't like will not appear to you in spirit world, he said. And then that, that, that cat, is, God created the cats. Uh, and, but, but, uh, what, uh, what God created, but if you don't like it, then a cat will not appear to you, the Father said. So I hear, when I hear that, oh, okay, I see. And then he, but all created beings were created for the human beings. So recently, uh, some people raised cats, uh, and uh, uh, they, um, uh, in the house, they, the, but the, they like the uh, cat in the house, and they, uh, 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 they carry it around and everything. And then they... But he, that does that does Oh look, mother. Uh, the dog does it say that the all the uh, oh, they treat uh, uh, cats and dogs uh, uh, as if they are children. See, how are you the mother of a dog? Uh, how are you the mother of a cat? But they treat their pets as if they were the children. They are carrying them around everywhere. Yes. And it costs more to uh, raise a, a dog than it does to raise a, an infant these days. And so that's the situation we have in today's world. And this is an incredible thing. A few years ago, I was in the world, I was going around the world, and I went back to a Korea on a Korean air. And, and he, I was going someplace in a... Uh, uh, when I'm walking around the city, it's a, I'm some, uh, when I hear a Korean... Uh, where language I, I'm attracted to that point, and um, I was on Korean air, and so the people next to me were uh, speaking Korean, and uh, a, a university student, a female university student, uh, um, uh, this is where you, uh, this is your seat, she said. I said yes, and uh, I was talking to her during the flight, and I said, I was born in an island, and then, and I went to middle school there. Uh, there was no high school there, so I, I came to a city uh, for the high school. I left my p parents and I left my siblings in order to, uh, and uh, and in the, uh, our our family is very tight, very close relations. Uh, but then I was left my uh, family for the first time in order to go to high school, and I felt and I felt that I was going to die because I missed them so much. Uh, the, and I uh, swim. Uh, I swim. I'm a good swimmer, but then. Even I wanted to swim to that island in order to see my family. And the, after after school, uh, I would go to the place where I was boarding, and uh, I would uh, go back and forth. Uh, I was looking to see if I could find uh, someone who might have come from my island. So I, that's how much I missed my parents. I almost couldn't breathe. Maybe you can't understand this. Uh, I would miss my parents so much that I almost couldn't breathe. And the and the, my parents uh, 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 sent me here so I could study, so I could not leave here and go back. So I lived like that for several months uh, until I went back on vacation. And at that time, because I, I, so I understood that my heart, so I asked this university student sitting next to me, uh, do, you, do you know anyone in, in the country where you're studying? She says, no, I don't know anyone. So did you come alone? She said uh, she came here when she was in middle school, and she was in high school now. Uh, not university, high school. So I asked her. Uh, we came from the same country, uh, but uh, we left. We missed our parents, and, uh, and uh, she was in a foreign country. No one with her. She was alone. She uh, foreign culture. And so I said, "What did you? Who did you want to see the most?" I I thought she would want. To, uh, I would want to see my parents, but she said, I, "I miss my dog the most." She said, "Not my parents, but her dog." That's what she said. The, this, uh, this dog that she was raising, and she said she almost would die because she missed the dog so much. And so she was going back to Korea to see her dog. Uh, it was just incredible. Uh, this house, this family, uh, they may be rich enough to send uh, their daughter overseas to uh, study, but they're making a mistake. It'd be better if they were, they'd be better off if they were farmers in the, in the countryside. And so today, that, but that is the reality that we have today. So... Human beings are not being treated as uh, human beings. Human beings are the, are the sons and daughters of God. And we, we, can, uh, we are very blessed because we are able to know this. So uh, the, 
in, uh, so our minds need to resemble God's mind. And uh, what is the essential? Is uh, Shimjong? Shimjong? What is Shimjong? It is the. Um, it is an it is an irrepressible uh, impulse uh, that wants to feel joy by loving the object partner. I want to uh, give. I want to love. And it is an impulse. It is a, it is a, some, not something that comes from outside, but it is an impulse that comes from within us. And we need an object partner to whom we can whom we can love and to whom we can give things to give. And so the original substance of Shimjong uh, is the attribute of God. And so within our uh, so that is why our mind also needs to resemble God's shimjong or heart. So that uh, shimjong is from the, from the true love that comes from that shimjong. The that true love, uh, when that is uh, uh, transferred into our lives, that becomes our character. And so we don't love because we want to receive something. But we want to. But we we have an impulse, an irrepressible impulse to give, and an irrepressible impulse to to love, an impulse, uh, irrepressible impulse to live for the sake of others, and I cannot bear not doing that. We don't. Uh, 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 we don't receive and give. We give and receive. It's not the receiving that is the issue. It is the giving, because God is the original substance of uh, of love and of. So and the more we give, the more we have. Um, uh, in the world, the more we give, the less we have. But in the world of love, the more we give, uh, the, the more that love increases within us. And so that is why, uh, only, that is why only true love can give us a, a eternal life. And that is the root of that is what? It is the Shimjong. And then the... This is Shimjong. If we talk about it, but people in America don't understand Shimjong. Don't know what Shimjong is. Is it, is it heart? It is the uh, that the organ in our bodies? No, it is not. So the the expression Shimjong only exists in Korean. Why is that? Because that is the country where the Messiah came, and it is the country that can in, that can talk about and, and uh, explain to people about God's Shimjong. And so that is why in Korea, the, uh, that is why uh, there is nothing in uh, uh, Korean that cannot be expressed. Even uh, even God's uh, world of uh, Shimjong can be expressed in that language. And that is and that is uh, how I uh, Korea. Uh, it is a, uh, the original substance of uh, divine principle is uh, expressed in Korean. So the so the to uh, to actually to to explain even the, the world of God's Shimjong, uh, how precious that is, and how difficult that is also. So, so then the so the 7.3 billion people in the earth, if they were to all, even if we are alone in an Amazon uh, next to a river in the Amazon, if that person, uh, if that person commits a crime, a sin, then he feels um, uh, pain in his conscience, because that is connected to God, to the original world, and uh, a pain will, uh, God will feel pain, and. And because all the humanity is connected to that uh, God, then all humanity will feel pain. And then, then that person who, who is aware of that, uh, even though he is alone in the Amazon jungle, uh, he will never sin, because he knows the effect that it will have on God and on the rest of humanity. So, but all that has been by the fall. All those relationships were cut off, and so the, to, and God's uh, restoration providence uh, is intended to restore all those connections, and that's why we have a Messiah. So, and He is the mediator, mediator, intermediary uh, between. And, uh, Jesus came as that. Uh, for he, he was a preparation for four thousand years were made, and then, but He was nailed to the cross and killed, and He, he said He was not the Messiah. And the two thousand years again, uh, he said. Uh, two thousand years uh, later, he came again, and as, and he came to this earth. And, this he, and uh, he was here for ninety-three years, and he completed his mission and went to the spirit world. And some people are still looking up to heaven and still waiting for the Messiah, but he already came. Uh, we attended him, and already he has gone to the spirit world. And now, we uh, we, uh, we have to uphold his will and to accomplish that will. Uh, what a huge difference that makes! Uh, so. Who, who are aware? It is we, it is us. We are the ones. So, uh, if we don't teach, if we know and don't teach, that will be a crime for us. So, if God has told us to uh, don't us to convey God's word. So, if, if you don't do it, then the uh, the rocks will will cry out. But you are better than the rocks, right? So, 
when I was a mapo and uh, doing pastor, I was a, a pastor. I, I talked about, I gave a sermon about the uh, witnessing. So I think uh, I said that uh, uh, if we don't go out and witness, uh, then I brought a rock into the uh, to the uh, to to the sanctuary and showed my members the rock and said, "If you don't go out and witness, this rock will cry out, and they, this rock will witness." But we are at least better than those rocks. So uh, even even if you just take a rock, you see, this is a rock, but is he? But this is but if I see it, though, that rock is, is a uh, a human being, though. Is a, so the so. But uh, human beings, uh, no matter how bad, how poorly, how bad you are, you're still better than a rock. You can still express yourself better than a rock. You can speak. You have a, you have heart. You have emotions. And you, um, I'm not talking about. It doesn't it's not doesn't work with the knowledge or or with uh, uh, with money. Uh, but it can only be done with love. Um, you cannot uh, buy people with the money. So, can you sell your heart with the money? Uh, has anyone sold their heart? Uh, it cannot be uh, traded with money. And so you can give to someone your heart. You can. We say we give someone our heart. That's an expression that we use. But we cannot sell it, though. You, it's not right. Uh, you cannot buy it either, even if someone were willing to sell it. But you can give it. So that is why that is the love is even more deep than deeper than that. So that today. How can we how can we complete perfect a mind that is a, resembles a God's mind uh, through a Shimjong and through the perfection of a true love, and when we uh, practice that, that is the perfection of our character. Uh, that is the He has given us all the elements, and it is our uh, it is our portion of responsibility to mature that and to grow that, and it is His responsibility to give it to us, and it is our responsibility to perfect that, uh, so that we. Become a being that resembles God. So uh, that that is why God's word is necessary because we cannot see Him. So that is why He gave us His word, and see within His word is His ideal and His ideal, His uh, heart and His and His uh, shimjong and His uh, character. And so well, I'm giving you words. The within these words uh, are. Are, are within these words that I give you are his uh, mind and his shimjong and his words and is he and also the direction of his providence are contained in these words and the uh, and they also uh, what he is trying to do here and also uh, these words contain uh, what we need to do so the so that is why the word is God and in the John it says John 1 1 it says that uh, that uh, in the beginning there was the word and the word was with God and the word was God it says and so the all from he created all the world from that word, and so uh, and so there is nothing that exists that is not the word. And we cannot see God, but in the what is, but he we but he is one, uh, but he is one with the word, and so that is why the word is God. So the word is Father. So the the principle is God's uh, content, and it uh, contains all that content. And so if it is not the principle, and if it's not the Father's word, then it is wrong. Just because Father's not here, uh, we cannot just uh, do anything that we want. We have the word that Father established, the, the, the Father, God's principle that He established. That is the law, that is the standard, and that is the order. This is what we, uh, we this is what we learned from Father. And God learned that He got that from God, Father God that got that from God, and He taught it to us. And, and we receive that uh, without paying a price, uh, without pay, having to pay for it. But we, it is our responsibility to perfect it, and to uh, so that uh, we can become, uh, uh, we can come before God, and to become, we have to become uh, people who are the model that uh, are models of that love of, of Father's words, of God's words. So. So uh, Adam and Eve could not do this uh, responsibility, and the and the do the true children also have this responsibility? Yes, they do. So, do we have the responsibility? Yes, we do. Do the true parents have that responsibility? Yes, they do. Does the Messiah have a responsibility? Yes, he does. Does God have a responsibility? Yes, God also has responsibility. So then, what? So who who says there is no responsibility? 
He is that person above God? So then now, now, here we are in a situation where there's just an incredible emptiness now. We, sometimes we feel, I feel it, we are very wretched. And did God, did Father sacrifice himself in order so that we could be like we are today? No, absolutely not. I'm sure that uh, he is uh, more lonely, he is more sorrowful uh, to see uh, the way we are today. Father said this to me. You see, I wonder how many um, Unification Church members will actually remain, he said to me one time. How many will remain? And when I heard this, there are so many uh, members around the world. Uh, what is he saying? How many will remain? I didn't understand it when he said that. But now, but he said, uh, don't lose your faith. He said, no matter how difficult it gets, you must protect your faith. He said, uh, he, he said this to me. Well, I said, well, faith is good. So, uh, of course, I'm going to have it no matter how, how difficult it gets. Uh, why is he telling me this? I didn't understand why he was uh, saying that to me. And, but, but now I see why he told me that. And uh, I'm now realizing many things behind the words that Father gave me. So here, this content is this, uh, this is the um, original substance that is the first cause. In terms of the relations, uh, they see is, um, everything is in relations, and so also subject object. So also uh, the uh, the uh, everything is in a subject and object partnership. But it's a four characteristics. But how, what would we say? It is a, the four, uh, we said there's dual characteristics in the, uh, in the God's first cause. So the but the internal nature and external form, Songsang and, and Hyongsang, are the essential uh, uh, dual characteristics, and then they have attributes. And the attributes are the uh, yang, yang nature and yin nature, or uh, positivity and negativity. And so, so they belong. So, they, the, so the blue, so they all exist within this blue circle in the middle. And in the, within the blue, uh, there's the uh, original substance uh, of uh, the uh, uh, of uh, song sang and hyung sang and of, uh, uh, of of young nature and yin nature, and so then the and also the universal prime force that uh, gives uh, the law principle principle law and order. So all this is within this uh, within the original substance, but the but the one it comes out as one point, but there's no area for one point, and so then that is the it has to there has to be a substantial body, uh, but that is the um, incorporeal. And corporeal uh, re, uh, re, uh, uh, substance, a uh, substantial body. But, um, the, but is that uh, but the, the point is there? But we just, but the, even if it goes down one kilometer into the earth, it is still there. But if it, but if it comes out, you say, oh, there is, there it is. But then, but is, but is that uh, light or darkness? Is that one point light or darkness? Is that one point going to be light, or a point of light, or a point of, of darkness? No, it's darkness. Is the because because but with the darkness contains light, uh, so so that point within dark, as it appear begins to appear, it, it, it appears as light. Within uh, light appears from within a uh, darkness. And in in the Bible it says that uh, God said, "Let there be light," and there was light. He said, "Do you think it would just appear all of a sudden, uh, just randomly?" So. The, how many uh, colors are in a rainbow? Uh, seven, right? So uh, when you come, when they all come together, what what color is it? Actually, it's black. So the, we see black, but within all are the what seven colors are there within black, and so then the so within all those within these seven, within that point, within the point. Uh, there, are, within that point of darkness, there are all the uh, seven colors. There are all the colors within that uh, darkness. So, in the same, the same with them, within, within God, all the attributes are there, but it is like one point, and there is no area. And for there to be area, uh, He has to appear as the substantial body and as two substantial, uh, and two substantial bodies. But and the uh, dual characteristics, and that's the, and He comes uh, in the form of the sexual organs. 
And so then the uh, human beings, then, we have the mind and body, and become, must become completely one. And mind uh, will uh, resemble God's uh, song song, and uh, within that is the uh, Shimjong and uh, 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 love, true love, and must resemble God. And in the body, it will uh, resemble God's body. And uh, uh, God is a uh, principled, and He has a uh, has order and and law. Uh, and uh, he, without the principle, God d does not uh, uh, move, does not do anything without the principle, and without order, uh, does not do anything. And so then. So also human beings uh, who were created to resemble him uh, also appear uh, as a man and woman. And um, each uh, and the man has a mind and body, and the woman has a mind and body. And we, and the man's mind and the woman's mind become one, uh, centering on God, and then uh, that, that's when they've been perfected. And then the, the God, the Adam I will be God's son, and, and Eve will be God's daughter. And this uh, son and, and a daughter uh, have a mind and body, each uh, resembling God's mind and body, uh, and they come together. And in the um, Adam's mind is a God's mind, and then, and so, but the but the bodies though do not become one. Only the mind. The mind becomes one, but not the bodies. But uh, but uh, but that does that does happen though in marriage until uh, they become one in body in marriage through marriage. So the Adam and Eve's marriage would be the marriage between God's two bodies. And so then, when the process of uh, who who is the uh, owner of that the process by which Adam and Eve become married, it is God. And so the uh, husband and wife Adam and Eve, what do they do? This is the uh, uh, so so then the. Uh, that's why Adam and Eve then would, would, would be would be the uh, body of God, and so that uh, one. So then the uh, Adam and Eve are not two, but uh, but uh, one. So we call uh, husband and wife have a have a one heart, one body, uh, one heart, one body, and one thought. That was to say, have the same purpose, the same uh, pur uh, desire, the same will, and the same body. But uh, the fallen world has separated those. The fall separated those. And that is why there is struggle and fighting. So why did they struggle? Why did they uh, separate? Because they got rid of. Uh, because they got rid of the original substance, and uh, Satan became the owner. So the, the 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 God of goodness and the God of evil, uh, and, it, and then the, uh, the original mind uh, and uh, evil mind. And how to uh, how to resolve this? How to uh, we had to uh, deal with the original mind. So the how to get rid of uh, our evil mind. So this so when it's ninety percent, eighty percent, seventy percent, five, four, one, then zero, then uh, it will be uh, we could be gotten rid of it. But we have to work on that for our entire life. We have to work on getting rid of the evil mind for our entire life. Sometimes we'll go to the second generation, to the third generation. If not in the third generation, then the seventh generation. So, uh, Father said that if it cannot be, what cannot be accomplished in three generations must go seven generations. So that is important for us today. And so here, in our uh, here in our conclusion, we have the it looks like a quadra uh, characteristics, but how many characteristics? Dual is dual characteristics. And because a uh, yang, uh, uh, yang and yin are uh, dual characteristics, and also uh, song sang and hyung sang uh, are also du uh, dual characteristics. And so, which is essential and which is attribute? Which is the essential? Song sang hyung sang. There's the mind and body. They are essential. And the, and not 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 husband and not uh, man and woman, but uh, uh, but uh, it's uh, about a mind and body. So so. So that and the uh, substantial bodies of that are the uh, man and woman on the earth. So when God created, He says that He created a man and woman uh, in His image. He says that He created man in His image, a man and woman He created him. And so that is Adam that He created, and He created Adam, and He did not saw that He was a uh, so that He should not be alone. And He so He took a, a, a bone from His a rib, a rib, a rib, and and. Uh, and it created a, a woman. And it means that it did not actually take a literal uh, bone from his body, but that he took the essential aspects of Adam and created Eve from that. And so Eve is his object, a partner. And so when God comes into Adam, 
then Adam will be God's body, and uh, when we see Adam, we see God. But then, the, but uh, Adam and Eve, when they're growing, they are the son and daughter. But they, but uh, they really loved uh, uh, God as his as his, uh, as their parents, and then the and then they then uh, when they once they uh, once they become married uh, and perfected, then uh, Adam would be uh, God's son and his body, and he would be. Uh, he and Eve, she respected uh, God as her father as she as she was growing up, but uh, 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 he would uh, he would, uh, uh, she would see uh, when she was ready to marry she would see uh, Adam as a God's son and also as her husband, and so the so but uh, as, as her subject part if this order is destroyed uh, then the, the uh, creation is destroyed so there has to be that order has to be maintained so the, 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 when they come together and they form a family. They they come together because of love, and why? As the uh, so to uh, to uh, express a God, the eternal God, in substantial form. That is why they come together. And so the most important uh, thing within this uh, first cause, uh, this uh, when we look at this diagram, we say the quadra of characteristics, four characteristics, as the, uh, the but there are uh, attributes of the you know, when we look at. This, but uh, to say that uh, there is a mother God and, and father God, this is what the liberation theologists say. Uh, so the, and the, right now, the liberation theology is uh, affecting uh, some people in our church right now. And this is wrong. How can they use uh, uh, theology from the secular, secular world to, uh, to some? This is not why we came here. If the Messiah who came after 6,000 years of providence uh, says that it is wrong, then it is wrong. But uh, if they just keep holding on this, says, no, 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 this is right, this is right. And who knows God's will? Who's the, who, who is the one who knows God's will? If he says it's wrong, it's wrong. And so that, he, so that is why God's original substance is just one. And that the one that, uh, uh, that his, has attributes uh, that are uh, in terms of mind and body. And the human beings are are in a, a form of a male and female. Does it, because we are male and female, does it mean that God is also male and female? No, it does not. So, as he, so the, if you look in Corinthians, it says that in Corinthians uh, that uh, uh, that um, uh, and it talks about this. And so, in the conclusion, that uh, he is the harmonized union. Is not the Song Sang Hyung Sang don't uh, exist separately, but they are a harmonized union, and they have they have a re exist in terms of, re of a relationship, even though they're unified a body, uh, still, uh, and then, uh, uh, and and uh, the uh, uh, internal uh, uh, internal character uh, is the subject, and the uh, and the external form is the object object uh, partner. And also with a yang form, yang form and a yang nature and yin nature also. The yang nature is the, uh, in the subject position and a, a subject partner position and yin in the subject partner position. So within the um, mind, there's also a yang nature and yin nature. And with the body, there's a yang nature and nature. So there are male uh, hormones and female norms. And so men also have a, um, uh, uh, there's all, men also have uh, female hormones, and, and uh, fem women also have uh, male hormones. They're not c completely uh, separate, uh, but, but they are harmonized. That is because it is in harmony that we have uh, that we have beauty. So why did uh, why does God uh, why does God have this content? Why did He create this way? Uh, we will talk about that later in this workshop. And uh, there is no one who teaches a God in such detail as we do here. So today. Uh, I wanted to uh, go actually quite a bit further than this, but uh, I've been explaining things uh, uh, more detailed than I did, than I had intended. Do you understand? So the but to understand that the but the original substance is only one, and his uh, attributes uh, are the song um, sang and hyung sang and mind and body, and the uh, yang and yin. These are attributes that uh, uh, so the that the. So that not that the yang is a uh, uh, song hyung sang and the yin is a uh, song sang. So if, if you explain, if you so, some people try to explain this in a way that you can have a, a female god and a, a, a male god, a mother god and father god, and it's like this. But that is that is false. And I think. 
And this is an internal nature, an external form. But uh, and uh, God created uh, centered on a uh, song or sex, and, so, and uh, we will go into an explanation of how God created uh, man and woman, and then. And I think if you go through that, then you will understand why God can only be a father and not mother. Because the seed, because of the seed, it's because of the seed. That seed, there can be a, son, a seed for a son and a seed for a daughter. But it begins with the seed. And we'll talk about that in the next uh, hour. And we'll finish now. And so let's have lunch. And then we will have uh, another uh, another hour after, uh, after lunch. So... Um, Please be back at uh, one fifteen, about one uh, or more than twenty-ish. Anyway, begin at one thirty. Your love is greater, your love is true.